Hopefully, and it's definitely feeling a little bit more like Christmas here on the Central Coast. I know that's kind of laughable for the rest of the country, but for us here, it's cold this morning. We've got temperatures below that freezing point in the interior valleys this morning, slightly more mild at this point, but we are continuing to see lots of those cold temperatures this morning. Now, checking out what we're currently seeing outside, most of the entirety of the Central Coast is nice and clear this morning, but as we continue to see those colder temperatures, the ground is actually significantly warmer than the atmosphere, and that means we've got chances for that Thule fog and some of the interior valleys We're going to be seeing some very limited visibilities, especially in the Koyama Valley. If you're traveling on 166 this morning, those visibilities are likely to be quite low and it's going to be cold in those interior valleys, really sticking around for the next few hours until we get a little bit warmer later on this morning. Checking out those temperatures in the 40s along our coastlines with a little bit more of that warmer air from our coastlines. 48 in San Luis Obispo, 49 in Santa Maria, 36 degrees in San Inez, just teetering on those frosty points at in those interior interior valleys at this point 35 in California Valley and the Cuyama Valley 35 in Paso Robles as well and 38 in Shannon only 37 degrees in Santa Barbara this morning below that freezing point in those highest elevations right now and we could see that become a little bit more widespread in the next couple of hours before sunrise because we've got all of these offshore winds now in the middle of the summer that means warmer conditions as we head into the winter that means that we're taking this much colder inland air and pushing it towards our coast. And that means colder conditions in the interior valleys. Even though the winds are not particularly strong, they are all pushing offshore. And that's going to keep us a little bit colder this morning. So cold, in fact, that the National Weather Service has issued a few watches and warnings. The first is a frost advisory for the Paso Robles area down towards the Tascadero. That's where we're going to be seeing the chances for some frost across the morning hours. But in the interiors, the chance for it getting even colder, that's where they have a freeze warning where we can see temperatures lower than 32 degrees for this morning. They're in place through 9 a.m. Just be careful out there. Grab that extra layer. It's going to be a little bit of a chilly one as you start off the day. But warmer conditions for the rest of the afternoon hours. 61 degrees in Paso Robles, 63 in San Luis Obispo, 64 in Santa Maria, 65 in Lompoc, and 64 degrees in Santa Barbara for today. Along our south coast, Goleta at 64, 67 in San Inez, 64 along most of those coastal areas in the five cities region, 63 in Guadalupe, 61 in Pismo Beach, and 56 degrees in Shandon and along our north coast as well. Lots more of those 50s still sticking around. 61 in Morro Bay, 61 in San Miguel, and 60 in Atascadero. Now this is what our overall pattern is showing. Lots of high pressure, not a whole lot going on. This that cold front is going to pass well up to the north of us, and we don't have a whole lot going on in our forecast. We've got a little bit more cloud cover for Friday than staying in the mid 60s, slowly warming up as we head through the weekend into next week. Either way, it can be much calmer than we saw a little bit earlier on this week. Aaron and Neil, back to you. All right, Vivian.